Hey guys, so I'm here to show you how to render Krita animations and how to figure out that um, really difficult FMPEG because I know a lot of people just totally give up on Krita because they can't figure this out. Like, I did it a while ago and I decided that I kind of need this because I kind of can't pay for any other animation softwares and it took me um, quite a lot of struggling but I finally figured it out anyways. There was um, quite a lot of things that I was trying to look through to figure this out and I realized most of the videos on how to render animations are really out of date so I was thinking, yeah, this is probably a good idea to make another easier, quicker one. So I was able to figure it out fairly quickly after looking at this page. If you're not able to, then I'll show you the steps for it. Um, I am on a Windows 10 with the newest version of Krita and FMPEG, so I'll show you how to do this real quickly. All you have to do is download your FMPEG. If you need uh, different versions, like I have the 64-bit, but if you have the 32, or 35, I think it's 32, yeah. If you have the 32, it works exactly the same. Once you have it downloaded, it should be in your downloads. All you have to do is right click and extract the files, then you can move it down here to your little smiley face folder, and it will be in here. This one's a different version that I did, but this one is my official version that I'm using to render my images. Right click on it and rename it FMPEG. It's actually not as difficult as all the old tutorials <laughs> I can speak as all the old tutorials make it seem like you don't have to code anything, at least this way. Then you open up your crypto. What I do is I don't Anime on Krita, I animate on Fire Alpaca, and then I import my frames. So, I'll just do a couple of these so I can show you. There's my five frames. Then you go up here to File and render animation. You want to click video, click this little file thing, go down to where you saved your FMPEG, open it, click bin, and click the one that just says simply FMPEG and it will open the right files that you need. Uh, you can make it a GIF and if you want to upload it to YouTube probably chose MP4. Make sure that it's on baseline. Okay and then choose where you want to save it to and it should render collect correctly if you leave it be you'll see all the frames show up on your desktop but then when the encoder finishes which is the fmpeg it will turn it into a video and if it doesn't work just try it again and if it, do if it didn't work then you probably didn't check that it was on baseline Now let's go check that out. And there it is. And <laughs> Chris is gonna be mad his face is in this. I can block it out, don't worry. And that's basically how you render animations on Krita. It's not that difficult. And it's not it's not as difficult as all the older versions make it seem.